Till I get up, time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading. Alright, guys, so let's do the unboxing now. As you can see, I've already done my own little unboxing. Right. So, we have some cables. We have multiple power cables actually. Depending on your country, you can use this. And this is the adapter, I guess. So again, we have multiple power cables. And uh, let's open this. Yeah. So, this is the actual docking station. These things. So basically, we have uh, three power cables, four actually, and this adapter. All right, so let's uh, let's see the ports here. So this is the power cable. This is the Type C cable. So this is actually the charging cable, which I was talking about, the 85 watt uh, charging pin. These we have 3.5 jacks, two HDMI. This is the gigabit port RJ445. So this supports up to 1000 Mbps, 3.5 jack is there and uh, we have one USB-C slot and also we have the power on and off button. Let me proceed, uh, let me show this cable here. This cable has a converter from USB-A to USB-C. So this, this comes in handy if you are using a Mac, right? So if you are using a Mac you can do this, if you are using Windows can obviously do this. Right. So let's power this on. Connected this to the power adapter and uh, just connect it here. Okay. So as soon as you connect, the, you, you, know, you can see a white light coming here. Let's turn this off for right now. And also, you can see that uh, I bought my two monitors here. Right. So let's, let's do the connections now, okay? So first thing, uh, I'm going to connect my uh, HDMI cables on this port, right? And uh, I have my RJ45 internet connection, just connected to the internet cable, okay? And let me just keep this here and get my laptop. Alright, so I have uh, a MacBook and uh, I'm going to connect this to the power cable, right? So let's connect it to the power cable behind and uh, since I have a Mac, just use this cable. Right. So as soon as you turn on, So the only software you have to install is this. So you need to go to displaylink.com uh, and click on downloads. So you have multiple operating systems to choose from. Uh, since I'm using Mac, I'll download the Mac. If you have, you, you know, if you have Windows, you can download the Windows as well. And uh, since I have a Bixer operating system, I'll just download this option. Obviously, you have to read the license agreement and click on accept All right so this will get downloaded I'll just download it to my desktop and uh, since I already have this application already installed I'll not go through the complete installation so I'll just show you the error which I'll get click on agree yeah you see here that uh, it says that I already have an application right so I'll just uh, go ahead and uh, close this so one more thing is you in uh, you know in the settings you need to allow um, the display to modify you need to go to settings and uh, click on privacy go to screen recorder and uh, first of all you need to unlock um, unlock this uh, let me give my password yeah so you need to allow this and lock it back 
and uh, that's it on the software part. So as of now, uh, there is no display, right? So as soon as you click this display link, you can see the display coming up, right? So the first display is on, the second display should be on, yeah. So here you have an option of uh, choosing what you want to do. You want to extend the display or uh, you want to do a mirroring, right? And uh, if you want to change the preference, you can just uh, go to the arrangement and uh, move around whatever you want. Right? So this is pretty neat stuff. Also, if you want to connect USB cables, USB um, pen drives, right? This Mac doesn't have an option, so it would have been a nightmare for all the Mac users, right? So you can just connect them here, and uh, automatically detects. So this is amazing, right? And we can also see that uh, this is charging right now. So let's test out the internet speed. So, as of now, I'm connected to Wi-Fi. So I'll just close the Wi-Fi and uh, open my Chrome. That's the speed, right? So, this is uh, completely on plan. So, getting close to 80. Yep. So this would so the maximum speed I had is 80, so this is like actually wired connection. So let's test out, uh, let me go ahead and disconnect this. Connect my Wi-Fi. refresh this. Yeah, so this is completely Wi-Fi speed. So since I have a 5G connection, it doesn't make any difference for me, but uh, I mean it's giving me the same speed, right? So the uh, home speed is 80 Mbps, so I'm getting the full speed. Perfect. So there you go guys, this is the A-Logic um, uh, docking station, right? So if you have uh, limited ports like I did, so this is the best way to, uh, I mean, utilize your single port, right? So we'll have the charging capability, USB capability, twin display, and internet as well. So I feel for the, uh, I feel uh, for the price range, this is an amazing product. So let me know what you feel in the comments below. Thank you. See you next time.